Welcome to the OpenShift with Volterra video series, Module 1, Volt Mesh with ARO. Red Hat OpenShift is the leading hybrid cloud platform. Volterra is F5 SaaS-based cloud platform. Running Volt Mesh as ingress and egress gateway for OpenShift, we can discover services and make OpenShift network services available. Let's explore our configuration. In this scenario, we will showcase using Volt Mesh to deliver ARO networking via three simple steps. We will create an Azure VNet site for ARO. We will discover the OpenShift application service, and we will create an HTTP load balancer to route network traffic to the Azure cloud. Now let's look at ARO. ARO provides organizations the ability to simply deploy an OpenShift environment with minimal overhead. It's jointly engineered, managed, and supported by Microsoft and Red Hat. It's important to note that given that these are jointly supported and managed, it makes the process of deploying an application substantially quicker. Now we're going to take a look at the Azure Red Hat setup. We have a standard six node ARO cluster. For purposes of this demo, we've deployed a simple hipster store application, which we will show shortly. We'll now log on to the Volterra console to create an Azure VNet site. Start by navigating to Site Management and select Azure VNet Sites. Click Add Azure VNet Site, and this will open the form to be filled in with the site's details. Following the wizard, we go ahead and fill in some details for the site. Here we are deploying the site to an existing VNet, or the ARO VNet. We'll use the site as an ingress gateway to the VNet, so select one interface deployment mode, save the configuration and move on. We go ahead and apply and wait for the process to complete and the status to change to applied. Now we go ahead to verify the site status. Here you can see that the site is created. It's successfully connected to two Voltaire regional edges. Moving on, let's move to the second step and discover OpenShift service endpoints using Kubernetes KAS service information. We go ahead and navigate to the management section, select service discoveries. Here, as you can see, we're configuring Azure Red Hat site for discovery configuration, select KDS discovery configuration and select discovery method field. Click configure under KDS discovery. We'll go ahead and configure the access credentials to the KADS discovery, enter the OpenShift Kube config for the secret field, apply the configuration, click and exit the information. Give a few seconds, refresh the page, and we can see and verify the service discovery. Here you can see it displays a number of services discovered. Click on the value display and it will display the list of discovered services. Moving forward, now we're going to create an HTTP load balancer to connect the Azure cloud to the internet. Start by opening the form and configuring the properties. Fill in all the HTTP load balancer details, enter the domain that was already delegated and will be managed by the Volterra cloud. Go ahead and create an origin pool that will be used for this load balancer. After entering its name, we go ahead and add the origin server. Select type for it. For this demo, we'll use the KDS name of the origin server for the given sites. Specify port 80 as a port where endpoint service is available and finalize the configuration. Click continue to apply the configuration of origin pool. Finally, we can go ahead and configure the HTTP load balancer to advertise the VIP to the internet for this demo. Save the configuration. And now we are ready to test the application service. We can access the application via Volterra Cloud. Congrats, you just used Volt Mesh to publish Azure OpenShift service to the internet and successfully tested it. Thank you for watching.